So the model that I'm trying to cover with you is very simple really. Yeah, I call it the think, feel, speak, do model. So the leader, all of us, are affected by the external environment. Yes, government changes taxes or something. Yes, we are affected, right? Yeah, some import duties increased. We are affected, right? So we are affected by the external environment. Based on what happens in the external environment, as leaders, we think in a certain way and we feel things in a certain way. Yes, we, are, we, we, we have emotions, we feel. We are happy, we are sad, we are angry, we are frustrated, we are annoyed, all of that, right? Based on the way we think. So we think and we feel. Yes? Okay, so far. Based on how we think and we feel, what I say and I do is different. Are we okay so far? Based on what I think and I feel, what I say and I do is going to be different. Yes? Now, my team member is also affected by the external environment. And in particular, so the environment, he's affected by the environment. He's affected by his boss. He's affected by what vision he has about the future, about the organization and all of that. He's affected by his beliefs. Okay, so far? What the individual is affected by has an impact on the way he thinks and feels, which then has an impact on what he says and does. And what he says and does has an impact on business results. Logical so far? What this guy believes and sees as the vision and sees as the environment is all tied up to the leader. Not everything, not everything. But think about it, right? If someone says, look, there is no future here, whatever, right? Yeah, and he comes to you and you believe, yes, there is a future here. We can do great things in this company. How many of you feel there is a fairly good chance that you can change this guy's thinking and belief? If you truly believe something is a different, how many of you believe you can change the other guy? We can, right? Somebody comes to and says, boss, I can't do this. How many times have you changed the guy's belief? No, you can. <laughs> yes, we do it every day, right? So. As a leader, we impact their beliefs, we impact their vision, we impact the environment, which has an impact on how they think and feel, which has an impact on what they speak and do, which has an impact on business results. So what I'm trying to do today, help us understand how we can be aware of and change the way we think, the way we feel, the way we speak, and the way we do things, so that that then impacts our leadership, which impacts them. Yeah. So we are looking at thinking, feeling, speaking, doing. Yeah. And if, if you heard of the thing called inspiration, it's true. <laughs> it's true. I thought of this model without really trying to think about it. <laughs> yeah. It just suddenly came to me. And I think that's inspiration. And you know, you break the word down, inspiration. It's coming from the Greek word uh, uh, in, in, in in theos or in, in spirit. Inspired. So you feel like the spirit is in you. You are inspired in spirit, right? Not intoxicated, in spirit. <laughs> That's a different way of uh, in spirit, right? All right. So it's all connected. <laughs> what I think is affected by what I feel. What I feel is affected sometimes by my actions. So if I energize myself, like we did in the morning, how I feel is going to start changing. I'm going to feel more alive, more awake, more, more, more energized, right? Which would in turn change the way I think. For example, Irendra. Irendra. If I say Irendra, you are awesome, Irendra. You feel happy, right? You feel awesome? Yeah, okay. If I say Manjula. Manjula. Manjula, you are good. How do you feel? Happy. Not as happy as Irendra? A little bit happy. Little bit. Not as much as him? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Words. Words. Yeah? So for example, if you say, guys, we have a problem. How do you feel? Houston, we have a problem. Who said that? You know? Do you know? <laughs> Houston, we have a problem was said by Apollo something. First flight to the moon. Houston was the control center, right? It's command center, Houston, we have a problem, right? So if you call your team and say, guys, you have a problem. Goes, problem? <gasps> What's a different word we can use? Challenge. Very good. People, we have a challenge. Challenge come. Challenge! Come on, challenge! Problem? Same thing. It's the same thing. But the words 
problem, we give different emotions, we give different thoughts, we lead to different actions. The word challenge, different. <laughs> this is how it works. It's very simple, right? Really. Have you all have you all realized that most of really impactful things are not complicated? They are very simple. They are very very simple. 